What if the voices of the gods were real? What if they were coming from inside your own head? Imagine a world where your thoughts weren't private, where guidance, decision, and even command came as booming voices you could not ignore. This is the core of the bicameral mind theory, a controversial idea proposed by psychologist Julian Jaynes. According to Jaynes, until about 3,000 years ago, humans didn't possess the kind of introspective consciousness we recognize today. Instead, their minds were divided. One hemisphere generated it instructions, while the other received them as literal voices, often attributed to gods or ancestral spirits. In this lost consciousness, people didn't ponder their choices. They obeyed the voices, believing them divine. Ancient literature and religious texts overflow with tales of gods speaking directly to mortals, not as metaphor, but as lived experience. Jaynes argued that these were not supernatural events, but neurological ones. As societies became more complex, stress and uncertainty increased, and the bicameral mind began to break down. Humanity transitioned into self-awareness, uh, gaining inner dialogue, but losing direct contact with the gods within. Today, the echoes of this ancient mind linger in our myths, rituals, and perhaps even in moments of intuition and inspiration. What if consciousness itself is an anomaly? A new Dadier chapter in the evolving story of human thought